Hey, Aloha Nerdy Geeks. I'm Derek, this is Van. Hello. Welcome to First Impression Tabletop Reviews. And today we are covering this, this magical game, The Magic of the Labyrinth, or just Magic Labyrinth. Mm -hmm. Not of the Labyrinth, just Magic Labyrinth. The most complicated game you'll play all day. Most complicated game. Mm -hmm. uh, and why is that? Uh, well, in this game, we have a secret labyrinth set up here. Okay. Uh, don't look. Oh, no, I'm, okay. I'm not looking. So here we have a secret labyrinth that we've set up that I don't know. I'm not looking at uh, what it is. And underneath there we have our magnets with little balls. So the goal of the game is to... Yes. Yes, I know. No, no, no. It's, it's, yeah. Okay, so we're trying to gain uh, these little magic symbols here. This is a little mushroom. Right. Open. So I'll put this right here. Okay. Uh, so you're trying to get there before I am. You're supposed to get five of them. We can play until just you get to that one. Okay. Or one of us gets to that one. We we'll do that source. by rolling a die and then moving along the path. If you hit a wall, you start over again. Okay. And you'll know you hit a wall because uh, you'll hit the wall and the, oh, the ball, ball will, will drop. drop. You'll know. Down. Oh, okay. You'll know. you'll know when you hit a wall. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. It's like all life. You'll know. <laughs> Those invisible walls Those of invisible life. Invisible walls of life. So I roll. Uh, uh, so I go three spaces. Yes. So I have to move you have to move, spaces. yeah, orthogonally, not diagonally. Okay, so okay. here we go. Oh. This is going to be a very easy game. Well, what hopefully. Heck was that? Okay, so three. <laughs> you dropped the ball. Thanks. Yeah, no, Thanks. No, no. Here you go. So I roll. And I go two, so it might be too easy. Yeah, way too easy. Congratulations, it's on that side. Oh, it's on the Oh! <laughs> of course. Here's a three. Okay. Huh. <laughs> I go. Oh, I got four. All right, here we go. <laughs> I did that before, didn't I? I'm so stupid. It's like a memory game or something. Yeah, yeah, totally. Uh, okay. Wow. It's a dark labyrinth, man. Uh, so I got three. Alright, I'm good. <laughs> Two. No, it's not yeah. <laughs> Ah, ah. <coughs> trial and error, man. Yeah, <laughs> lots of lots of error. Yeah. Okay. I kept doing the same move over and over and over again. It's fine by me. <laughs> anyway, what's your first impression of this game? Um, I really, really like this game. Yeah. I thought it was just for kids, but uh, I played it with a bunch of adults, and they just loved it. nobody could remember where things were. It was great. <laughs> well, yeah. that's one of them. Yeah, totally. Uh, I, I loved it too. I, I love the simplicity of this game, but yet it's complex with the setup. Mm -hmm. you know, uh, I remember at the start of the game, I saw you spin around. Yeah. Spin it around, and I had no idea what you were doing, but now I do. Uh, because you probably could memorize where everything goes, right? Yes. Are you able to change the maze that's inside? Yeah, absolutely. So I'll show you what we didn't uh, oh, what we didn't have before. So this is all set up pre-game, so you just take these little slots out. And you, can ah. move them. you just have to make sure there's no boxes. Oh, okay. But yeah, you can see where you went. Yeah, yeah. All the way around there, yeah. I, it, this is well designed. I mean, everything is like uh, conclaved properly, so I'll go to a second section. Uh, I love that you draw little tokens. It tells you where you need to go. And the randomization is really good. Uh, it's a very clever game. Uh, and I'm, I'm totally into it. I, I definitely probably go on Amazon and see if I can, can find one and whatnot. Uh, other than that, I thought it was a great game. And give it a try. And give it a try with your kids, too. I think they will like it as well. Mm -hmm. uh, other than that, uh, that's our first impression of this wonderful game. Uh, if you have any comments, uh, leave it in the comments section. Or give us a like and subscribe. Other than that, we'll see you next time. Hey, everybody. Thank you for watching my video. Hey, if you can, give it a like and subscribe. We appreciate any kind of comments that you guys can give, so leave a comment below, because any kind of feedback is great feedback. Also, thank you to the Armchair Adventurer for hosting us. As always, you can come to their store, check out games, try games, and hopefully buy games. So remember, whenever you're at the Armchair Adventurer, get your game on.